Hi guys, it's been a while since my last video and I've had a few comments on my unboxing video of the Louis Vuitton Initials Reversible Belt asking to see how it holds up over time. So I thought I'd do a quick video just to show you the belt today which is um, about a year and two months after I bought the belt. Obviously it's not a belt that I would wear every day but I've probably worn it about 10 or 15 times in the last 14 months since I bought it. Uh, I always keep my LV belts in the dust bag in the box in the wardrobe. So this is the belt today. As you can see it's held up really really well over time. Um, there are no marks that I can see on the buckle and also the canvas is held up really well as well. There are no marks or scratches or anything like that. And also on the back, on the leather side of the belt, you can see that there are no marks or scratches there. And the holds often get stretched on belts like this, but as you can see, the holds on the belt don't have any stretching. It's still in a really nice condition. The only minor wear that I've noticed on this belt is on the hole where the buckle attaches. There is some very slight stretching to the hole there. I don't know if you can see that, but it's very, very minor and it doesn't affect the belt at all. And I think there's also a very light scratch just on the black leather there where the back of the buckle sits. It's only very, very light and you can hardly see it. So yeah, as you can see, um, I've had this belt over a year now and it still looks practically the same as it did the day I bought it. Obviously Louis Vuitton is very expensive, uh, nobody could argue with that, but I really think that the investment is worth it. When you consider how long these items last, when you consider how well they hold up over time, and also the resale value as well. Because Louis Vuitton never have sales, they never reduce their prices, the prices only ever go up. Uh, there are no outlet stores and you can't buy new genuine Louis Vuitton from anywhere else apart from Louis Vuitton themselves. The resale price can often be as much as 80 or 90% as the price you paid for it. For example, the Port Valeur wallet that I unboxed in one of my earlier videos, I used that wallet for probably about a year and a half. And after that it just sat in the wardrobe for several months because I wasn't using it. Um, I'd switched to using the Pocket Organizer as my everyday wallet because it was so much smaller. So I ended up selling the Port Valeur wallet on eBay. And in the time since I'd bought the wallet, Louis Vuitton had increased their prices by about 30%. So I ended up getting about 90% of what I had paid for the wallet originally when I sold it. And I can't think of any other brand where you could buy a wallet, use it for a year and a half and then resell it for almost the same price that you'd paid for it originally. Um, I've had a lot of cheaper wallets in the past and they've lasted maybe six to eight months and then I've had to buy a new one. So the cost of actually owning and using that Louis Vuitton wallet was less than if I'd bought a £40 wallet and used that. I'll just show you the pocket organizer as well since I'm making this video. This has been my everyday wallet now for the last six months or so and I use it every day. It goes into my back pocket and I keep cash in there, I keep credit cards, receipts, uh, loyalty cards and everything in there. And as you can see it has really really held up well over time as well. Um, there's no stretching, the stitching is all still intact. There are no marks and scratches on the canvas or the leather. There's a very, very small smoother area on the canvas there at the top and there's some very, very minor stretching to the credit card slots where I've been pulling cards in and out of there. But really, considering that I've been using this every day for the last six months, um, it's in almost perfect condition and again I could resell this wallet for a very good price um, compared to what I originally paid for it. So yeah, obviously not everybody can afford Louis Vuitton, it is very expensive but I do think that you get what you pay for. Um, Louis Vuitton is a luxury brand and it lives up to its reputation, it is very very good quality and uh, it is a very good investment. So that's it for this video, thanks for watching.